Hello guys, uh, today I'm going to show you how to enable the 3D Max files uh, preview templates in your Windows Explorer, okay? So let's start from the Explorer. Normally we cannot see the preview of the 3D Max files in your Explorer, something like this. Okay, now I got this chair preview in my Explorer as a JPEG file, but <coughs> but you cannot really see the 3D Max files in your Explorer like this, right? So how you gonna change it? It's very simple. There are only a few steps you need to do, but first of all, you need to understand uh, how these things works. So normally we can only see the 3d max file preview only in the 3d max application which is something like this so for example um, i want to see the preview of the 3d max file so i need to select <coughs> the 3d max file then i can only see the preview only here the thumbnails and which is very very small and it's not it's not uh really good you can re you can really see properly what is going on on this file. So, I I did some changes so that I can see all my 3D Max files preview in my Explorer or even in my this 3D Max uh, Explorer. So you see, so everything every 3D Max file you can see all the previews before you open it so how to do it how to do the, to achieve this kind of effect this kind of preview okay so today i'm going to tell you exact exactly how to do that okay okay first of all we have to open the command uh prompt command prompt so we just go to the search from your window search then you just type C then now you can see command prompt you normally you can simply click left left click on it then it will run but in this case don't click right uh, sorry the left click because you need to open it as the administrator so what to do is you just right click on it then run as administrator okay so yeah you just press yes then now the command prompt windows pop up all right then in this case we we, we are going to change the registry some code of the, the registry num uh, registry so uh, we need to have some coding so in that case, I will provide you the coding in the description below. So for now, I just copied it to my uh, notepad. Then <coughs> I just copy here. Okay, first of all, the most important thing is what kind of 2D Max version you are using right now. So for example, right now I'm using 2D Max 2018 version. So that's why I simply put it as 2018. But if you are using 2016 or 2020 or 2022 or 2021, whatever it is, you need to correct here. You need to type in your version here. Okay, that's it. That's the main important thing. Now after you change your uh, 2D Max version here, then you just copy it simply copy then you go back to the command prompt then you just paste it control V then that's it then what you need to do is just press the enter button okay then the system will tell you okay your this registry number blah blah is ext.dl succeeded this is more important if this one don't show 
That means this process is not successful. So in that case, you maybe you press command prone with the right, uh, sorry, the left click. That's always happen. So that's why I told you. Command from the command prone, you need to press right click and run as administrator. Okay, as long as you press run as administrator and the copy and paste it, then it will be uh, showing this kind of succeed status okay that's it guys then you just press ok after that you can close everything everything then uh, you can close this notepad also but if you want to keep this coding for the future for example if you change your computer or if you change your workplace then if you want to have this kind of effect then you can save it you can get anywhere from wherever you save okay so for now uh, I can close it okay I don't save it so now let's see in your explore okay after you finish that step in the command prompt you will definitely see you will be able to see preview of your 3d max file here everything will be there okay so for example okay this is the the chair and th of the jpeg and this is the preview of the 3d max file so it depends so yep uh for example <coughs> um let's say uh, uh i will select one of the file here okay see I can see my profile, uh, my 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 preview template here. So okay, see. So this is how you you will be able to see after you change the setting. This is very simple. Okay, and this will help you a lot, a lot in your process. It will speed up your 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 process and and everything. Okay, this is very important for us. You know. Sometimes we 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 gonna need to merge the objects and three D models from your library. And in that case, it will help you guys. Believe me. Okay. So if you're a three D Max user, you need this definitely. You will need it. You'll, you will love it when you got it. Okay. So yeah, today that's it. So see you next time. Uh, I'm gonna. Uh, I will be posting some of the tips and tips later. See you guys. Peace.